Lane's winger. The Shillington shot blocked by Hyman, who will try and get by him. And here's Zach Hyman with the lane. In centers. Back and come bouncing puck. Arks to put around his end, but it's getting waved off. Emphatically waved off by Chris Lee in behind the Flames net. Yeah, Lee is right on the doorstep and almost sounded like the whistle did go. As you can see, Zach Hyman feeling like it might have gone in before the whistle. We'll have to take a quick look at that. And the one thing that Lee's having a talk now is when did it happen? Great individual effort though. Jumping by Shillington, keeping the play alive, trying to get it across. A nice stick by Markstrom, but now... Oh boy, that's awfully close, isn't it? Have a listen, does the puck go over? before the whistle. And so often with these, Chris, it's the referee can designate that he was in the process of yes, blowing the whistle. Of blowing. And yeah. at times you don't even get to look at it. It does look like they're having a good conversation with the situation room to make sure that Puck didn't go over before the whistle sounded. Well, if you're Jay Woodcroft, you know, here you go again, you get down by two, but one thing that took a while to get in game one was a little bit of a spark in life offensively for the Oilers, but here they've been able to rally back with quick response here from the officials. Viewing the play, the play on the call, stands, we have no goal. So Jay Woodcroft would like to follow up on, on that. You can see that from our vantage point, with replays, the puck loose, but from his vantage point, he was blowing the plate dead, thinking he lost sight. I find it interesting, though, it's not Chris Lee who's having to talk with Jay right. Woodcroft, it's Lee's partner, Steve Kazari. It's have another look at it again. These moments so critical. The whistle did go, but the puck was free. And that's the argument of the Edmonton Oilers on that one is Markstrom never did have control and did have his glove on it. And instead of allowing the play to go, the whistle went.